Hello, good afternoon, good afternoon. I am back. Good afternoon, everybody. This is for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Don't forget to check your charts, like, share, subscribe, and also comment. Starting next week, I will be doing two lives for Pisces a week on Wednesday and on Sunday. So starting next week, we'll be getting a midweek live and an end of the week live. The rest will be videos, so just be a little aware of that. I'm going to start something new. We got a lot more fans now. I was waiting to a certain point. I said I was going to wait until I got the 1K subscribers, but I went ahead and decided to push myself and tell myself I'm going to wait till I get the two. So thank you so much to all the supporters that have got me to 200, not 200, 2,000 subscribers. No, we are way past 200. We are at 2,000 now. We're a little bit past 2,000. So I appreciate every single one of you from our cross watches. This energy can be resonated. So just be a little aware that as we are in tour this season, happy birthday to all my Tauruses out here. It looks like some of my Pisces have a nasty past with a Taurus. Somebody could be currently dealing with one right now. Some of you could be married to a Virgo, possibly dealing with one, maybe have kids with one. Somebody also could be dealing with a cancer right now. This is for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Somebody could be dealing with a cancer. Somebody could be dealing with a Capricorn as well, possibly a Scorpio for some of you, possibly a Libra. Somebody could be dealing with an Aries too. This is for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Okay, so we got trust the universe is the first card to pop out. So it looks like you kind of gave it in when it comes to something. This could be spiritual growth for a lot of you. A lot of my Pisces have grown spiritually, I'm seeing. We got strength and guidance. We got transformation. So somebody just changed who they were. It looks like it took spiritual growth and a little bit of guidance. Could be people around you. I'm seeing cut the course. So transforming could have also been cutting someone off. A lot of you divorced could have moved out. A lot of you were staying with someone, I'm saying. Scarce plans. So a lot of you got your shit together. Came up with a plan that was going to work for you. For a lot of my Pisces is out here. This is for Pisces, Sun, Rising, and Venus signs. Don't forget to check your charts. Like, share, subscribe. Thank you. I appreciate every single one of you. We got Earth and Ground. We got some Earth energy here. Somebody could be dealing with an Earth sign. Possibly a Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. We got Yes. So we got an opportunity coming in. It looks like you need to possibly say yes to this offer. It looks like some of you got, got an offer coming in. We got some type of offer coming in. For some of my Pisces, this could have been a situation to where you were wondering if it was for you. Not even a past situation. This could be a current because I wouldn't say this is a past yes. Like, no, something in the past is meant for the past. So this is current right now. We got honesty and communication. So it looks like you're about to get some answers possibly from an earth sign. Could have been someone you cut off or cut the cord, possibly. A lot of ease and grace, forgiveness and understanding. So we got some reconciliations coming in. You could be making up with someone. You could possibly make up with an ex for some of you. Hopefully not. A lot of you are staying clear of the ex. Some of you got a real toxic earth sign. This could have been a fire sign for some of you. Maybe an Aries or a Sagittarius as well. This is for Pisces, some of rising and being signs. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and also comment. Somebody can have a 19-year-old, possibly. We got shame. So somebody's ashamed of something, a fearless love. Okay, so some of you are ashamed. You feel like you love too hard. Some of my Pisces could be a little ashamed. They feel like they love too hard, so you try to hide it. Somebody could be 25, possibly dealing with someone that age, maybe. We got to speak up. So it's something that some of my Pisces that need to speak up on. This could be your feelings towards someone. It could be why you're feeling ashamed. This could have been somebody's energy towards you as well. This energy can be reflected. So somebody could be 33, dealing with someone that age, possibly 35. We got intuition. So somebody is using their intuition right now. Somebody's using their intuition right now when it comes to dating as well. I'm seeing we got resistance. So some of you are holding yourself back when it comes to something, possibly someone. Somebody could be 22 to possibly dealing with someone that age. This is for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. I appreciate all my Pisces out here. Thank you for tuning in. Somebody could be possibly 33, 32. Okay, so we got the truth coming in for Pisces. Somebody could be 34, possibly dealing with someone that age. We got intuition and the truth. So we got some answers coming in. It's possible that you already know the answer to something. And it looks like you're about to get that confirmation that you've been wanting. Somebody could have a 12-year-old, possibly. Maybe a 6-year-old. 
We got manifestations coming in for Pis Pisces. So we got something big coming in, something that you've been wanting. Somebody can have a nine-year-old possibly. This is for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. Somebody just got married. Congratulations or possibly engaged. A lot of you just moved in with someone too, which just popped out. We got laying foundations. So somebody's doing something to secure the future right now. Securing the bag big time right now. We got share your voice. We got speak up and share your voice. So it's something that you're hiding. Something that you're not speaking up on. What are, what are you clinging on to? It could be someone that you're clinging on to that you're not speaking up to for some of my Pisces. It looks like your love so strong for somebody. You don't possibly don't want to hurt their feelings, possibly. This could be work-related for some of you. We got protection. Call back your power. Cut the cord. So we got some soul ties being released. We got some soul ties being released for Pisces. Longing for home, belonging, beauty, devotion. So a lot of you... Have it's a lot of self-love and self-practice here. We got yes again. So it's a situation going on in your life right now. You're wondering if it's for you. This could possibly be a person. The answer is yes. We might got true love here for you. Just be a little aware of that. We might got true love here for you. What's not aligned in your life? What needs to change? Some of you are wanting some type of sub, some type of sudden change. What is this nuggling feeling trying to tell you? So your intuition could be trying to tell you something right now. So we got postpone, pause, say no. So for some of you, your intuition is telling you to say no to a situation. It looks like it could possibly be for you and possibly this person, but your intuition is telling you to say no for a lot of you. What is your soul calling you to do? So we got a mission. Some of my Pisces are on a spiritual mission right now. A lot of you are trying to grow spiritually. A lot of you are trying to release a soul tie as well. I'm seeing a lot of you trying to release a soul tie here. Your vibrations are rising. You're gonna go get you're gonna get through this. It's a big miracle coming in for Pisces. You are going to get through this. Thank you for tuning in. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and comment. Thank you.